Is Jordan Love playing today? Full injury update for Packers quarterback. Just nine days ago, the Green Bay Packers were holding their breath after Jordan Love went down in the final moments of their Week 1 loss to the Philadelphia Eagles. The sight of their franchise quarterback in pain had fans fearing the worst. Luckily, the news wasn't as devastating as initially feared, Love suffered a sprained MCL, avoiding any major structural damage. However, the question quickly turned to how many games Love might miss. Early reports varied, with timelines ranging from two to six weeks. In the meantime, backup quarterback Malik Willis has been preparing to take over, with Love sidelined and unable to practice. Initially, the Packers listed Love as questionable for their Week 2 matchup, creating some hope that he might suit up. But by Saturday, that status had changed, and Love was effectively ruled out. Jordan Love not expected to play versus Colts in Week 2. The Packers downgraded Love from questionable to doubtful for today's game against the Indianapolis Colts, all but confirming that he will not be playing. In a corresponding move, the Packers promoted backup quarterback Sean Clifford to the active roster, providing depth behind Willis. According to Diana Rossini of The Athletic, Love is expected to sit out not just this week, but next week's game against the Tennessee Titans as well, calling his chances for Week 3 a long shot. NFL insider Tom Pelissero offered further insight into Love's recovery timeline. Speaking on The Rich Eisen Show, Pelissero revealed that Love's initial recovery window was estimated at three to six weeks. However, there was early optimism that he could return sooner. It would take a minor miracle for him to play today, Pelissero said, emphasizing the likelihood of Love missing at least two games. Welcome to the Malik Willis Show. With Love sidelined, all eyes turn to Malik Willis, who is set to make his first start for the Packers in their home opener. It's a tall order for Willis, who only joined the team 20 days ago after a trade with the Tennessee Titans. Learning an NFL playbook in such a short amount of time is no easy task, but head coach Matt LaFleur will undoubtedly simplify the game plan to ensure Willis is comfortable. Though Willis is still relatively inexperienced, with just three career starts and no touchdown passes in the regular season, he has had more time to develop since his rookie year. While his early NFL career has been marked by three interceptions, the Packers are hopeful that Willis's additional time to grow will help him deliver a more composed performance this time around. LaFleur's offense is known for being quarterback-friendly, and the coaching staff will have tailored the scheme to minimize pressure on Willis. Hashtag 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 what's next for Jordan Love? Although Jordan Love is ruled out for today's game, the Packers are hopeful that his absence will be short-lived. His progress will be closely monitored, with Week 4 against the Minnesota Vikings circled as a potential return date. In the meantime, Green Bay will have to navigate at least one, possibly two games without their QB1. The hope is that Love can bounce back quickly and rejoin the team before their season hits a critical stretch.